The U.S. Food and Drug Administration will finally let gay and bisexual men give blood after a series of protests that fought for this. The regulatory body will allow men in monogamous same-sex relationships without abstain abstaining from sex under newly drafted guidelines. So the thing is, is to donate blood, you go through the questionnaire and one of the questions is, you know, have you had sex with, um, with another, if you're a man, have you had sex with another man? It, it has a, a time constraint of within a certain period of time. They're saying that if you're in a monogamous same sex, re sex relationship, you can donate blood without having to um, abstain from, from sex for a certain that certain period of time. The rules are expected to be implemented in the following months where applicable donors will now be able to complete individualized risk risk assessments. So, I wonder I wonder if they're going to view the blood that comes in from admittedly gay men under more scrutiny. Um, I don't think it's probably a bad policy to do that. I know it's it is still discrimination, but um, with the, the greater risk, maybe it's a, um, a good safe policy. We have a strong data set by Talent Research Institute Director Brian Custer said, we have highly relevant information to envision what an individual risk-based approach would be like. So they have a way to approach this to make sure that the blood that, that people get in um, transfusions is still safe and that everything which, um, you know, the, the blood is looked at. So it, it does go through a process but um, they, they have a, a way to see through to solving this problem and allowing gay men to donate blood, which blood donation is a very important and very vital thing. Um, it, it really does save lives. I've been very proud to be able to donate blood for uh, many years. And um, with the exception of COVID, COVID has really wrecked that pretty badly. But um, it, it's, it's one of the best ways that you can do, give a little something of yourself it's about a half hour um, and have a massive impact on somebody else's life. Um, if, if you can stand the idea of, of the needle, then uh, it, is a very, it is a great, great way to help others.